Hey guys, it's Red and just got home from student teaching. And out of package. This is not what I expected. I thought it was going to be a lot bigger. And I thought it was going to be like a big collector's edition. 100 bucks for this because of the shipping. And I thought it would have came early. It didn't. My friend got his early and he just had the normal limited edition. But I have to get the collector's edition because this is like my favorite game of all time. So. I need to get this one. And it was limited. But I'm just surprised by the lack of size to this thing. Lack of substance. I was hoping it was going to be bigger. I like how it says all regions. Maybe that's because it's region free. I'll show you the back again. There's beautiful Yuna. Oh yeah. Oh, I can't wait. There's cutting the plastic there. Woo! Oh my gosh, now it looks better. Still, I wish it was thicker. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, how does this come on? Okay. Ooh! So it's a big version of the limited edition is what it looks like. It's everything it comes with. This slides off. Um, the limited edition is this, except it's it's about half the size. This is a full 8.5 by 11 let me see. It doesn't say, but I believe it's like 8.5 by 11, by, like the size of your notebook for school. This is a uh, pretty cool looking. I wasn't expecting. I wasn't expecting it to be like that. I thought it was going to be different. And I thought it was going to have a separate art book, but it looks like it's within it. So we'll see. We'll see here soon. Some beautiful artwork. I love it. It's an actual book. See, it's a book. Let's see what we got here. This is artwork. I got several different arts. And I got the soundtrack. Here's the the case the new case is uh what it looks like if you have a normal version. You can flip it upside down. And there you go, it's the opposite. It kinda makes Titus look uh feminine there. I don't think he looks that girly, but when you put Yuna's face on top, I think she... Oh, I have this uh, scene uploaded already. This is one of the best scenes ever. Made me cry the first time I saw it. It, it is... Uh, it's, pretty, it's pretty awesome. You have to check that out on my channel. I have that uploaded already. And this is... Uh, this is from the end of Final Fantasy... Uh, 10 2. Ooh, Yuna's ass. Okay, there you go. <laughs> Keep his PG 13 at least. Um, yeah. This is some. This is really, really, really nice artwork. And there's Titus. Stand in the water with his sword. That awesome blade. And this is from some artwork from the original. Final Fantasy Ten Two. I think that was on my collect. On my, uh, I don't think I have a strategy guide for actually for that one. That one I have nothing. Uh, I do now. I have that remaster guide. Whoa! What is this? Is there a code on here? Where's the? Whoa! 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 What do we got? Oh, the soundtrack's already in here. Okay, right, this is an entire soundtrack. It has, this has the credits and all the music and everything. It has 104 tracks. So you're getting, that's one of the main things about this collector's edition. It's like $60 or $50, 50 to $60 separate. And you're getting it with this. So that right there saves you some money if you didn't have to pay for the shipping. And then it tells you how to uh, make this go straight to your PC. Um, let's see what else we got. Here's the art book. Um, they got a warranty guide. Final Fantasy on the front. Uh, talks about getting started. That's all they have about it. It tells you how you can have seizures, limited warranty, um, limitation on damages, and then they have this tiny getting started. What's this? 
Um, we got a square NX register card. I don't know what any of these do. It doesn't seem like they do anything. Oh, I had one for Final Fantasy 13 2, or for 13. It's supposed to get into the Final Fantasy 14 beta. And the beta never came out for several years. <laughs> so it was pointless to even have that because they started giving it out to PlayStation Plus members, I think, too. Um, I guess I'll show you the entire art book. Since this is literally really rare now, I don't. They're sold out online. They were last time I looked. And it has some cool things that are written. When Final Fantasy X and Fen Final Fantasy X 2 first released, they were praised for many technical achievements, including beautiful art design and among the high highest quality graphics of any modern video game. Over a decade later, it has been my honor to revisit the world of Spira. This universe is so that is so deeply embedded in our hearts and memories once started as just an imagination lovingly put to paper. From my heart to yours, I thank you for your en endless de de ugh, devotion and hope that you cherish the art within these pages as much as I do. This is our gift to you, the fans without which... Final Fantasy X slash ten two HD remaster would never have been possible. May your journey be a memorable one, and praise be the Yevon. And that's uh, the producer of this game. He wrote that in the front there. That's pretty. That's a nice little note. Ooh, these are some nice high quality pages. Um, there's Arn, and you got that Riku picture. That picture was my screensaver for a long time. On my PS3 too. Um, it was on my computer. I had on my fat PS3 forever until it died. And I even had it on some of my slims. I just like got the picture. Uh, this is my favorite Aeon right here. Uh, Shiva. She's my favorite. She was my favorite. Uh, in this version, I don't like her on the 13 one, how she's like a murder cycle, it's weird. 13 made the, I think they're called, I forget, are they Aeons or Espers? I can't remember. But they're not as cool as they once were. Oh, and they even have like little um, parts here, little uh, captions. This scene popped into my head when thinking about a, thinking of a place in which the logo is displayed. I focused on making the piece a man it the underlying theme that is connected to the ending. Right there, that one up there. That's uh, that's where they start and it ends. Uh, let's see. Cool artwork. And they all have this one's cool a mountain gag gagazette. These are just some, look at the shoe puffs, they even have them in there. You can see the shoe puff. This artwork is really amazing. Um, I'm just sharing it with you because I know a lot of you probably won't be able to get this because if it sells out, if it stays so, sold out, you won't be able to get it. I had to get, this is nice, 40 pages of artwork. Um, I'm trying to go... Here's some of the characters. The, the rest were like some early artworks of Men <laughs> Highway. And there's Yuna. It's some early artwork it looks like. I mean, it even talks about each one. This is a really cool. I like this picture. This is in the walkthrough. Uh, I mean the strategy guide. Strategy guide. Um, it's there's a page in there that looks like that. This is Final Fantasy X too. This artwork looks pretty, pretty high tech compared to the other artwork. Oh, I love you. I love you, Riku. She is my favorite Final Fantasy uh, person. Um, let me see. Okay, we'll go to Yuna. We can go back to Yuna. Here's all Yuna artwork. What's that down there? 
That's a Moogle outfit. Here's Pain. The she sort of looks like a younger um, Lulu. That's what I get out of it. <laughs> she kind of looks like a younger Lulu. And Final Fantasy X 3 was actually supposed to be Riku's story, and they scrapped it. I believe that's what it was. Um, that's what I read. And they scrapped it. They better freaking make a Final Fantasy X 3. And if they would make it on Riku, maybe they'll scrap that idea. If they would make it on Riku, I'd be freaking so happy. Um, they made all this hype for this game. It's already out selling Final Fantasy uh, Lightning Returns. Let's see. Oh, there's a beautiful one. Beautiful artwork, oh my gosh. I didn't think it was... There you go, this is the last. And then the last one's a, an image cut out. You can take it, cut it out of the paper, put up on your wall. So that's nice. Um, yeah, and right here is the last stuff for this. This is Final Fantasy 10, 10 to... HD remaster. That's what the disc looks like. It is beautiful. I actually got us. I actually got a limited edition, so I can compare it. Um, basically, this is probably like a big version of that. Except that one's like forty bucks. Uh, I paid thirty-five. It was on Newegg.com. And I can't get it out. I can't get. Ugh! I don't want to screw it up. There we go, got it. And that is the soundtrack. That's what it looks like, the disc. It's on a Blu-ray. Can't use that on my computer. My computer's only DVD. So you got all that for that. I wish it was a little bigger and there was more, but I'm happy. I am a very happy man. I love it. Um, the artwork is what really impressed me in this collector's edition. Um, I do think this is a different style. I actually like steelbooks better. If, uh, if there's an actual steelbook of this, I will try to find it and buy it right away. I'd pay $100 just for a steelbook of this. I love this game. Um, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up, comment below, and subscribe. If you want to donate money towards uh, I'm buying Drakengard 3 which cost about a hundred dollars. It cost ninety eight dollars with the shipping. Just as much as this, uh, it was the collector's edition or limited edition of that. There's only like five thousand made. I bought that one. And there's some Japanese games I do want to buy, but I don't have the money at the moment. So if you want to donate, donate a dollar or donate five dollars. Maybe donate ten dollars. Um, I'll give you a shout out in a video. Um, make sure you write like a little note like on the pay to the PayPal thing. And you can also pay through a credit card to my PayPal thing. So if you pay a dollar, I'll give you a shout out. And I'll put your name like at the end of the video. So, there's that. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to check out my videos. And I already have like several endings. I have just the ending. Ending and cutscenes. I mean ending and credits. Uh, and I have ending and eternal calm together. I have like them in separate little t types of categories, so you can watch them how you how you want to watch them. Like you don't have to watch. Uh, maybe you just want the credits and the cut in the ending. Maybe you don't want the credits in there. Maybe you just want the ending and the eternal calm. I have them cutscenes all in there, and I have just the eternal calm cutscenes all in there. And I will be doing a full walkthrough, a couple of different walkthroughs, and I will finish them. Um, some companies don't give me enough time to finish them. So, I work on the next project next, and I do end up trying to finish, but it takes a long time. Especially with teaching. I have about probably 200 papers to grade, and that's so much fun. Thank you guys for watching. See ya.